here, back with another FOB video. Today we're going to be calibrating some Firefox notches that I've done. I've got them on a really sweet extreme rate pink silicone coated soft touch shell. Some buttons from Two Ghost Gaming. Yeah, and yours truly notches. I'm still learning, so uh, they can be better, but uh, let's plug in and give it a go. So today we're going to be using uh, Smash Scope to calibrate because it's just way more accurate than using Uncle Punch or 20 or XX or any of the other ones. I've got it here already installed, but I'll include some links in the video to both Dolphin 5.0, which you need to run it, you can't use a slippy version, and Smash Scope by the Goom Wave dudes. So I've plugged in, we're going to boot up Smash Scope, press B to activate the sticks, press A to go into controller test. So this one's pretty self-explanatory, and I've already calibrated this controller so it's already pretty good. But let's just go ahead and mess up the calibration to make it a little bit more fun. Press AXY and start to exit safe mode, press AXY and L to exit enter calibration mode. Now here's where you would usually follow what your C-stick is telling you to do, but I'm going to start doing weird things and try and mess up my calibration. So now the main stick is thoroughly toast. So why don't we start off with just doing regular old calibration. So let's press A, X, Y, and L again to enter the calibration mode. C stick is now centered. So we're going to press L and then hold completely to the left, or to the right, sorry, and press the trigger again. Neutral, up, neutral, left, neutral, down, neutral, Diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal. Here's where you would start doing the Firefox notches, but we're going to skip those for now and just see how accurate it is off the rip. Let's go into the notch visualizer. Wow, we're already pretty dang close. That looks good to knocked back in, but oh, I can see that my thing will be a little bit in the way here. Let's move these guys out of the way. Oh, hey, look at that guy underneath there. Yeah, so our notches are already pretty accurate, I would say. But let's go that one step further. We'll go back to the other screen. Press A, X, Y, and L to enter calibration mode yet, and we're going to go the full way this time and then talk about how to adjust them. So neutral, right, neutral, up, neutral, left, neutral, down, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal. One more neutral, and now we're doing the Firefox notches. So I will hold to my first Firefox notch, neutral, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, neutral, seventh, and our final Firefox notch, the eighth. Now this is asking us to calibrate what we would like the north east notch to be. Um, usually most people leave this at 0.7, but I have found that shifting it inward to about 6.2 or 6.125 can allow you to do up airs easier, which is a neat thing that you can try. But for now, we're going to press B to reset that back to 0.7. And so we will skip these two notches. Down to the left relates to shield dropping and ledge dashing. 
So you would adjust those values based on what you want those to accomplish, either up to get, be get a better ledge dash angle, or down to match uh, non-UCF shield drops. But we will skip those two and go to our first Firefox notch. So you can see right now that currently it's in it, that notch and it's sitting at about 3.7. So the X and Y buttons will now do clockwise and counterclockwise, removing and adjusting that notch, like you can see me doing now. And I'll adjust it until it's sort of in the middle of the sweet spot zone for those Firefoxes. I think. I'm not a Fox player. You can correct me in the comments. But we're going to shoot for 325 or 3125. Go on to the next one. And tap it in. So we're just seeing what number we have that is close to 3. And adjusting that until it matches 325. Going all the way around really slowly and carefully. 325. Do the next one. Went the wrong way there for a second. Three, two, five. And the last one. Perfect. So we should have finished calibration. Let's go back into the notch visualizer to see how close we got. Wow. A lot of greens off the start there. Would you like to see? Okay. The bottom left one is a little bit. I don't know. They're all still looking pretty good. I'd have to say that I was happy with this calibration. You know. You would give it to the player and ask where they feel like they're missing them over the course of a little bit longer, and then adjust the notches to personal preference too, like that down left one might need a little bit of work. But yeah, that's been calibrating Firefox notches. I'm sure there's lots more questions that you might have, but uh, I'm just hoping to answer the very surface level ones. Please let me know if I uh, was aiming for the wrong notch values or things like that. But uh, yeah, hopefully 